Welcome to the 26 gauge stranded Connect Tech demonstration video. We are going to demonstrate connecting a BNC connector to a 26 gauge non plenum mini high res cable. You want to make sure you have the correct components of your connector before you start. You need to have a compression support ring, a pin holder with the pin inside, and then also have the connector body. The connector body and pin holder are both identified with an orange color in order to make sure it's for 26 gauge stranded cable. You also want to make sure you have the correct tools. The CM-mini strip tool, the newest revision of this, has the cavities marked with the appropriate gauge and it has a black blade holder. You also want to have the correct crimp tool, the CM-tool, and make sure your die is set up for VNC RCA. Your first step in the determination is to cut the cable square. So you take a pair of diagonal cutters, cut the cable, and you want to pinch the end to make it round again. You take your strip tool, open it up, and place the 26 gauge wire up against the backstop and allow the tool to close. Do not squeeze the tool. Grip the cable as close to the tool as possible and give it a few spins around. You can feel it cutting. You want to remove the tool by opening it and removing it. Do not pull the slugs off with the tool. I will pull the slugs off by hand. Nice clean strip. I will fold the braid back. I want to be very careful not to damage the center conductor. I do not want to hit it, knock it over, bend it, because if those center strands become unraveled, it won't grip the pin very well. Now, the change in our directions is we put the pin on first. So we're going to put the pin on now versus the compression support ring. We will lay this on here and allow gravity to let it drop on there. We don't want to push it down because if you do, you can cause the center strands to birdcage on the center conductor. I will spin this down. It's just like a wire nut that has threads. And once it seats against the dielectric, the brass pin will seat all the way against the dielectric. I will pull and there's the pin on the dielectric. Next step will be to apply the CSR, compression support ring. Push this hard all the way down, you should have about two tenths of an inch of dielectric showing after you push this on. <clears throat> Taking my connector, I will insert this assembled cable into the back of the connector until it seats all the way. I can see the brass compression support ring showing in the sight window. Take my tool, open the tool up, place the BNC connector in the tool, gently close it, making sure my connector is lined up with the tuning forks on the die. Keeping pressure on the cable, crimp, and there is my completed termination. I can now color code it with a marking band if I wish, or leave it just the way it is.